welcome back. I look like a whole mess because it's one o'clock in the morning and I decided to film Vampire Uraraka Cause. I should, no, it's not that I should have. It's that I did film this a couple of days ago. I was not in the best mood and I forgot to put in fangs, which really negates the whole vampire part, you know? So then it would just wouldn't be Halloween themed. So tonight at one o'clock in the morning, I'm gonna get into this cause and then take my tired ass to bed because I have to wake up at nine o'clock in the morning tomorrow. So I take Venus to the doctor, to the vet, to the place where she gets checked. Oh, bars, bro, bars. Get right into it. I'm gonna pin these bangs back and I'm gonna tell you why season three of Seven Deadly Sins hurt my feelings. First of all, it felt like it was possibly the longest season of any show I've ever seen in my life. It wasn't. It was 24 episodes, but it hurt me. Where should I begin? Ouch, is what I would like to say for this season. What the f***, bro? Also, look, new My Hero shirt. M uh, Walmart has new uh, My Hero merch, if anyone was wondering. They also have socks. I always let you guys know when Walmart has new My Hero merch. The is crooked in the bathroom. Is it crooked? Don't you kill it, they're good my, luck. You can imagine my concern when I was <laughs> and I turned and it was staring at me. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Where was it at? Is it a cricket or a cockroach? Do we have to move? Mm -mm. It's either a cricket or a grasshopper. I f hate grasshoppers. The same as crickets. I hate them both too. Also, you guys, I will not be putting makeup on the side of my nose because m my piercing is very bothered lately. Fun fact, I think I'm sick. POV, you're my mirror. I've had this piercing for a year and a half, but it has been a pain in my ass. Anyway, that's what we're having. We're having seven deadly talk today. Oh my god. Oh my god. Anyone? I'm so slippery. It's just so hard. <laughs> I'm having such a hard time. Oh, I got it. Anyone who has seen season three of Seven Deadly Sins, did it hurt you as much as it hurt me? Because I cried, cried like the whole time. Not even the whole time. Okay, so we watched like 10 episodes and then we stopped for two weeks because we got so damn busy that we didn't have time to watch it. And the first 10 episodes were fine, dandy, what the hell ever. And then episode 10 through 24 decided to personally rip my heart out and stomp on it as Bond did to Molesculus. Except I don't have seven of them. I have one and it's crushed. <laughs> anyway. Listen, you can hear the sweet sound of rain. Raining here in the DMV because apparently there's a cyclone here. Oh, what time is that one's out? You can't listen to it on my Whatever, let's hear some kids. I didn't need that tonight. Oh, Ariana! <laughs> First seven deadly and now these, bro. I'm trying to smack the pain away. <laughs> I am Nikki Cavalli and I don't know how the f to feel things without laughing at them. You marry me, your life is bound to be with love, bound to be filled with laughter. That sounds like an actual nightmare. Anyway, Mac Miller was mine and Vanessa's favorite artist. <laughs> was mine and Vanessa's favorite artist. Mac, Mac Millie got us through some hard <laughs> times. I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what. And he died in 2018. He passed away and we were supposed to go to his concert. Two months before we were supposed to go, he passed away. He was also Ariana's ex-boyfriend. Anytime I hear anything about Mac Miller, I cry like a <laughs> oh god I, there's so many fuzzies on this it's all over my face <laughs> we were watching seven deadly first of all jericho bro <sighs> she has been through it her parents is dead she is in love with the man that will never love her back because he is in love with the tiny child <laughs> She's 2,000 years old. Okay, I take it back. Elaine is a lovely woman. I just like Jericho more because I am a <laughs> for someone with a sad backstory. <laughs> I love it. They're my favorite. I like Jericho. Personally, I ship Jericho and Bond so hard. See, quick thing. This just goes to show for everyone who was like, well, that'll never happen. Like, you know, you shouldn't ship them. I know this one's not gonna happen. Am I still gonna read Jericho and Bond fan fiction? Most definitely. Because they are so cute together. I love them. <laughs> There's a pussy in my mouth. You guys, I'm spiraling. <laughs> Shout out to Sammy Senpai for teaching me a new word. <laughs> I cried so hard because Deanne doesn't remember who she is. Jericho's family is dead. Very cute that, that Bon was there supporting her. So ow. That's all I have to say about Seven and Deadly Sin Season 3. Owie, 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 owie. It hurts me in my sternum. Just as, okay, but what was up with that guy stepping on Meliodas? There's the file I've been looking for. What was up with that? Why was he doing that? What was his name? Zeldris. Zeldris. Well, this is the main guy. He was, who was he? Face? That's yeah, it. Yeah, close enough. On a happier note, I put my Spotify playlist in my link tree on TikTok and Instagram. You can go listen to my music. And apparently you can see what I'm listening to when I'm listening to music. 
So, you turn that off. No, I think that's cute. You guys can jam out with me. My favorite song right now, not one of my favorite songs, but a song that I do heavily enjoy is Pluto and Neptune by Sleeping at Last. It's very good. I really like it. Neptune mm, makes me feel some type of way. I'm getting new glasses. That's exciting. I went to the eye doctor on Tuesday. I guess I'm just, this is a life update because I feel like I haven't talked to you guys in so long. I know you're lying to me at this moment. You are not dying. Are you dying? Oh my God. My camera died. <laughs> Season three of Seven Deadly Sins hurt my feelings, and here's why. The whole thing with Meliodas, huh? No, no, mm -mm. ouchie, 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 ouchie. I'm in Spain and the S is just so silent. <laughs> I can't, I can't do it. I, I'm sad. It just, it, it, it pains me that he's afraid of himself. I don't know why, it just brings me mucho pain <laughs> that he's in pain. Anyway, I'm getting new glasses. Why am I so... I think I have ADHD. Anyway, that's not the point. I think that's as flat as I can make my nose look. And I'm gonna put blush over it. Okay, I have an actual real life question. How are you supposed to kin characters? I've been having a crisis. I'm very scared I don't kin the right characters. I don't know why. Does anybody else fear that? Does anybody else fear that they're like lying to themselves about who they kin just because they enjoy the character and they're like, they want to be like them and so they're afraid that they're not actually that good of a person? Just me. Cool. Okay, anyway. I don't know. How are you... How does, is there like a, a specific way someone's supposed to kin a character? Is it supposed to be that you kin them because of like a similar backstory? Or is it supposed to be that you kin them because... Nikki, this is all made of consent with, with, with drawing. I think you can do whatever the f*** you want. Am I doing it wrong? <laughs> like I'm <laughs> nervous that I'm doing it wrong. I could have made any character into a vampire. I specifically made Ochaku a vampire because I'm sad. <laughs> Getting into Ochaku makes me feel better. <laughs> yeah, I hate it here. What about you? I made her a playlist on Spotify. Do I want to talk about it? Apparently. Because <laughs> my mind said, Nikki, tell someone. I'm literally so annoying. Oh god, sometimes I can't even stand myself. Anyway, that's not the point. As per usual, same products I use for literally everything. Don't, please don't look at that. <laughs> this pretty clean elf brush. Blush. Ah! And this um, good old born to glow because I'm sparkling. Then this Milani concealer and um, this thing called pain. I'm in so much pain. I'm in physically in so much pain. I can't with this season, bro. With the Meliodas and with the Bond. Not even with the Bond, but like with the Jericho and the Bond. And the Bond backstory. Oh, don't even get me started. Oh my God. This poor man. Shivago, Shivago. If I want to call him Trivago. <laughs> Shivago. Shivago. Oh my god. Oh my god. No. Oh, this. No. No one told me it was gonna hurt me like this. You made me like it with all the feel good first season and the nice little lovey dovey second season, and then in the third season, you decide to stab me. Why? Okay, I didn't want this. I wanted a feel good and I'm gonna rewatch Yuri on Ice. I can't do this. It we're is. watching Haikyuu after this, right? Oh, we are watching Haikyuu after this. That's why we're finishing it, because we want to watch Haikyuu so we can learn about Oikawa, so we can learn about Mila. I'm very excited. I want to see who I'll kin from Haikyuu. I wonder if I'll kin anybody from Haikyuu, because I don't really kin anybody from Seven Deadly. My cats are going to be so mad at me tomorrow. We have to drive 45 minutes to their doctor's appointment, and they... <sighs> You're gonna be so freaking mad. So Venus, not as angry with me as Jupiter is about to be. Jupiter holds grudges. Venus forgives me in like five seconds. I've been putting this liquid in her ear because she has an ear infection and she's been just been like hanging out with me. She's like, hey mom, I love you. Jupiter, I swear to God, I touch him the wrong way. And he like, like straight up won't talk to me for two days. So like putting him in a cage and driving him 45 minutes tomorrow to his doctor's appointment is not gonna go over well with him. In fact, he has to get his rabies shots. So this should be really interesting. He's gonna hate me. On the way home, if you're so if you see me crying on live because my cat doesn't like me, mind your business. <laughs> <laughs> that is something that like really gets me. If pets don't like me, oh my god. I don't think I'm a rising Aquarius. And here's why. Here's my theory. My mom doesn't know the actual time I was born. Because somehow, Vanessa and I were born at the exact same time. <laughs> that sounds like she has a favorite to you. In her defense, I was the first girl and the best I child. I was the most <laughs> recent child. I was the best. It's, it was 20 years ago. You couldn't remember the time you gave birth to me? She had a lot on her mind. <laughs> you can imagine her distress when a small baby was being pushed out of her uterus. I'm in a lot of pain. No, I'm not in pain. I'm over that. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. No, wait. Hold on. See, I think I'm a rising Gemini. <laughs>
I'm a rising I whatever. It, actually. A rising Gemini. The indecisiveness for me. Are Geminis indecisive? Generally, if I recall. I need to know what my rising is because I, okay, so here's why I think I might not be a rising Aquarius. Well, one, for one, I don't know the actual time I was born. Like, my mom has to find the papers because on your birth certificate, it doesn't say the time that you were born. It just says the day, obviously. The thing is, is that they're in, like, these papers downstairs. My mom is, like, she's really busy. I don't want to force her to go through them, but I myself, if I destroy her closet, she will end me. And then there will be no need to know what time I was born because I'll be dead. <laughs> I'll definitely write down the death time. I was on Google last night, and it was, like, saying, like, the nicest signs, like, all these, like, traits about the signs, and I was reading them, and I texted Vanessa, she was downstairs, it was like 4 o'clock in the morning, texted Vanessa and I was like, hey, since when is da 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 like this? And she was like, that is so wrong. Vanessa knows a lot about zodiac signs because she too went through a phase where she was obsessed with them. Basically, Google was wrong and we're like... it changed within, you know, you know, last year. I don't know. I don't think my rising is Aquarius because I found that out on Google. I think it could be wrong because when I was reading stuff from CoStar, it was completely different than what it was saying on Google. So either I don't actually know the time that I was born or Google's lying to me or both. I really You're might be a rising it. Gemini. I think you might be as well. I think yours is perfect. I think yours is spot on, but we've always known the time that you were born. It was 9.06. Because Vanessa said she's pretty sure I was born at night. So I, I can also four, so don't quote me because I also didn't check. <laughs> Watch. So anyway, to sum this up, I don't think I'm a rising Aquarius. Whatever, what's the sign that hates themselves the most? That's the one that's me. <laughs> I don't, I don't think that's a personality trait. Oh, I just think that's um, emotional issues, oh. baggage for me. I can't be like, sorry, I hate myself. I'm a Leo. Like you know what I mean? <laughs> I don't know because I, don't, I Google got me like feeling some type of way now. Now I'm scared that I, it's not correct. And I know that like it's not a big deal to anybody else, but I really like to know that those things about myself. It's weird because I like to know things about myself because I feel like I don't know anything about myself. And it's doesn't really make any sense because I am me. Is this just therapy? Damn, sorry. I'm gonna put my hair in this wig and it's gonna be in the most half-assed way because I'm gonna put it in this wig, I'm gonna put on the teeth, and I'm gonna get out of cause. Because <laughs> I have to go to sleep. I was very unhappy with season three of um, Seven Deadly. I, I mean, we're gonna continue watching it. You didn't like it at all? I liked it. It just like, it was very sad. I just really didn't need that. It was very good. I liked that we got to learn about all the characters. Like I I definitely wouldn't like say, I wouldn't stop watching the show because of it. It just really hurt my feelings and I don't think I needed that. But you know, it comes with the territory, I guess. I mean, I still loved it. I loved it so much and honestly, I'll probably rewatch it, but like, Ow. This is gonna be really gross to get on. I hate getting these on. The other day, we made these bangs with polyplastic for your mouth. You have to get the ones for your mouth. And then I'm using this denture cream to stick them on. It's from Walmart. The polyplastic is from Amazon. Put these in here. It's disgusting what I'm about to do. I hate it so much. But I'm just gonna put it in for a few pictures and then honestly probably take it off and take a shower. And you form them to perfectly fit your teeth. It's disgusting. It's so gross. It gets so sticky. It gets so sticky. And it gets all over your mouth. It tastes so nasty. Uh, uh huh. I'm salivating a lot. Now I'm stuck together. And they're stuck on me now. And now I'm a vampire. With denture cream, your lips get stuck. So my upper lip is literally stuck <laughs> to my teeth. You get used to it. It's a disgusting feeling when you first put it in and it's not gonna be comfortable in any way, shape, or form. But you know what? It is what it is. I'm sorry I was complaining. I feel like every single time I film a cost video, it's just me complaining about something stupid. But if you guys haven't seen Seven Daily Sins, I highly recommend that you should definitely watch it. It will definitely make you feel some type of way, especially season three. This is a vampire or rock cause. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you remember give it a big old thumbs up and if you're new subscribe if you want to i have so much more stuff coming out you see how weird i have to talk because my lips are literally stuck together if you can see my if you can see the denture cream on my lips no you can't i love you guys so much i kind of dig the things so though i'm not gonna hold you i love you guys so much and i will hopefully not be stuck to myself in the next video <laughs> happy halloween <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you like Vampire Uraraka Cause. Check out the Cause channel if you want to see her because you will definitely see Vampire Uraraka so much more because I love this cosplay too much not to do it again. And remember to stay safe, do your homework, and drink water, and I will see you in the next video. I'm sorry this was such a disaster. It's because I am simply a disaster. I love you. Bye.